Okay, it's me, Keila J, and Deidre D. And we are the women on the stairs. Except there's no stairs. We're always climbing for success. Well, we want to talk today about women being more forgiving than men. What you think about that? It's in our nature. We just forgive, forgive, and forgive. I mean, as women, I think it's in our nature, it's our parish, you know, it's, it's just a part of who we are. We're we're nurturers by nature, so, you know, okay, you, you did such and such, all right, you sorry, okay. I think that if, um, that women are more forgiving than men, hands down. They can cheat. We can see them doing it. They can lie and whatever. They'll go right back to doing whatever it is tomorrow, next 30 minutes. We continue, continually forgive them. But they aren't as forgiving to us. One example I want to use is that when a woman has cheated, she doesn't even have to be caught cheating. If someone tells him, mm. or if she tells him months later, years mm. later, he does not want her. But us, we can catch him at the woman's house, or even in the bed, with the woman, and and he comes home with us. Well, I guess I've heard men say, I don't want you if some other man is planting seeds. So if the woman has physically slept with another man... Mm -hmm. He don't. He no longer wants her because somebody else been there. But as women, you know, our partners or spouses or mates can go and do something, and they come and they say, "Oh, I'm sorry. You know, I never do it again," and we forgive them. Well, we say we forgive them, but I, I just don't know if we genuinely forgive them. I think it's always in the back of our mind that they go to the grocery store and they're gone too long, but you don't. But we forgive, and we press forward. Except for, I think, this new generation of women. They like, bye. Yeah. Well, I've been in relationships where I've forgiven, 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 and I will give you so many chances until it's none left. And it's silly of me because I actually then feel sorry for them. Feel sorry? Mm -hmm. I feel sorry for them because when Keela J is done, she is done. And I mean not just as far as a man relationship, uh, you know, a physical or uh, mate relationship. I mean it as even a female-female friendship. We've been friends for years. When Keela J is done, I'm done. I'll give you chances, chances, chances because I try to preserve it because that's the kind of person mm -hmm. I am. But once I'm gone, that's it. That's it. And if men would be... um. If women, if we wouldn't forgive them, well, sorry, I'm, I'm getting confused now. If the men would forgive us like we forgave them, I think that they think they would feel like they lost. They're not strong. Somebody came into their castle and conquered their queen. I think they feel that way. Well, I don't want somebody with my king. But they do it all the time. And if we would just get strong enough to let them go like they do us, then I don't think that we would have a lot of problems with cheating anymore because they'll be like, I'm tired of it. She's going to she she put me out. Away. She just she's gone. Not gonna, she gone. Yeah. She gone. I mean, I, I agree completely because I say it's so easy for us to say I'm leaving versus staying in a relationship, being committed, and being faithful being committed to that person and just saying, you know, this is where I am. And better yet, being honest and saying, baby, I'm having some thoughts, I'm having some feelings, and some ain't right. It's a possibility I'm getting ready to step out. I, we as people can't do it. No, we're not going to do that because we say we want the truth, but we really don't. I want the truth. I really do. I would rather you come to me and say, baby, guess what? I'm having well, I would rather you tell me before. Yeah, before, not after. But then when I catch you, I would rather you say, yeah, because you want, you want to play mind games and make me think I'm crazy. Yeah, I don't want you to deny it. I don't want you to hide it from yep. me or make me feel as if, you know, I'm the one that's crazy because, I, you know, I know what you've done. 
you know, I don't want you to, you know, and then just be honest about it and, you know, let's see what, give me the option if I'm going to, you know, work it out, deal with it, exactly. or, or if it's time for you to go. It's just that simple. Because that, because cheating is a lie. I mean, you, you got to cover it up. You got to keep covering your tracks. You got to remember what you said, where you were, and all of this. Now, there was a episode, I didn't see it. One of my friends saw it. I don't look at it. If I see teen mom, it's on mistake. I've been turning and bam, there it is. Well, there's a couple on there. I can't tell you their name because I don't watch it. Not that I don't want to give it to you. I just don't know it. There was a couple on there. Um, they got married. But before they got married, the female slept with an ex before the marriage. Well, on down the line, they've been married six months. And he finds out, she tells him, or whatever the case may be, he wants a divorce. They have a set of twins. He does not want her. He does not want her. He wants a divorce after six months because she slept with her ex before they got married. If that was us, it was over and done. We moved forward. He doesn't want to do that. Women are more forgiving than men. I agree. So... What do you think? Please leave your comments. Please subscribe. We're working towards something. I promise you, you will want to be a part of it. Yes. Thank you for the ones that are viewing. Uh, but just leave more comments. We enjoy this. You see, I like to talk a lot. <laughs> but I'm going to sign out. This is Keela J. And Deidre D. And if you acting a fool, lay down. And don't get up. Bye.